In this video, we're going to talk about ankle impingement. I'm Dr. David, orthopedic surgeon, sports medicine specialist, and author of the book, That's Gotta Hurt, The Injuries That Change Sports Forever. I provide education, information, and commentary on all sorts of sports and exercise, injuries, injury treatments, and injury prevention for athletes and active people so that you can stay healthy and perform your best. Ankle impingement is probably not one of the more common causes of ankle pain, but if you have it, it can really drive you crazy. This is basically, you know, in the ankle joint between the end of your tibia, your shin bone, and the talus, the lower bone of the ankle, you can develop scar tissue or even bone spurs that then sort of pinch in ranges of motion and can be really tricky, especially as you go to what we call dorsiflex, pull your foot and toes up towards your head, you know, you can either a little bone spur or scar tissue can cause pain with that motion. We see it a lot after somebody that's had a lot of ankle sprains or maybe one really bad ankle sprain, but you can see it also in people that just did a lot of impact activity when they were younger, you know, maybe football or something like that. And it can be really kind of tricky diagnosis. X-rays can help show a bone spur on the end of the tibia that could be impinging for sure. But if it's scar tissue, you may not pick up on that. So the doctor, by his physical exam and figuring out where you hurt, where it's tender to palpation, that can be really helpful. Yeah, sometimes they might get an MRI to evaluate for other issues and also see if there's you know any scar tissue or something that might potentially be causing it. Sometimes we'll even do an injection of cortisone into the ankle joint just to see if the pain goes away because that can be a good way to at least think that maybe ankle impingement is going on. Now, sometimes physical therapy can be helpful, activity modification, anti-inflammatories or ice, but sometimes scoping the ankle, arthroscopic surgery of the ankle to clean out scar tissue or to maybe even smooth out one small bone spur, that might be particularly helpful as well. It's worth talking to your orthopedic surgeon about, see if that potentially could be the cause of your pain, find out what treatment options are available to you. All right, do you have ankle pain, something that might be ankle impingement? Or have you been diagnosed with ankle impingement before? I'd love to hear your experience. In the comments below, tell us about it. Not just me, but anybody watching this video, because it could really help everyone watching this video that might be dealing with ankle impingement. I can't answer specific questions that you leave in those comments, but I do read them so that I can understand what you're going through. Speaking of an injury that you might be going through, I'd love to hear the biggest injury challenge that you face. In the description box below this video, the very top link will take you to a page on my website where you can tell me all the frustrations, all the struggles you have with your injury. That information, because I do go through those, it helps me design videos and design articles and write articles and design courses that can better help you. So that can be really helpful to get the information that you need. All right, if you like videos like this, you want more information on sports and exercise, injuries, injury treatments, and injury prevention, subscribe to my YouTube channel. I record several of these videos every week, plus I do some videos that are a little more fun and you know, sometimes live videos. So if you subscribe, you'll get notified when I'm live and you'll get the other videos to uh, deliver directly to you. Click the subscribe button in the upper right corner of the page. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this was helpful if you're dealing with ankle impingement, and I look forward to seeing you right here next time.